Hello, this is Joel, and welcome to part 16 of my Fallout 4 exploration video series. Okay, so uh, look on the map here. Uh, I, I am across the water from Beantown Brewery right now. And there's one thing that's right over here that I want to show you real quick first, and then we're going to be heading into the Beantown Brewery. Okay, well, first thing we're going to do is hit a rad X and then we're gonna go down here to this building now there's um... there's lots of rads advanced lock to open this door got it and when you go inside there's a bunch of baby mire lurks up there But you can loot this guy, and then there's a red steam uh, industrial. Whoa. A bunch of baby mirelikes gonna drop down on you. And but there's a red steamer trunk with with an industrial trunk with some cool loot in there. And I think that was it. And I think there's another baby mirelike gonna come in at us. But they have uh, Marlock meat. Sure, why not? There's another one somewhere. But I'm getting lots of rads. So let's get out of there. Hmm. That sounded bad. You know what? Let's stop sneaking. Let them see me. Whoa. Oh, um. In here, there's a captain's hat. A uh, sea captain's hat. And that was. And now there's even more of the. Baby Marlowe's. But they're not coming. Jeez, look at all the reds I'm getting. I'm wasting my time with this. Something's wrong with me. definitely worth using up a rad X and two rad aways and a stim pack <laughs> anyway so the steamer trunk in there is the reason you go in there but uh, okay so now we're heading over to Beantown Brewery there are two entrances one is the front entrance here and if you go in the front entrance, it just means there's more people you have to fight your way through to get to the cool loot. Uh, but if you have advanced lockpick and come around here to the back door, you will want to be stealthed when you start picking the lock. Yes. And here we go. Anytime. Okay. You know, when I came in here before, I think there was a guy asleep or something. Uh, not this time. Oop. What the fuck was that? Come on, hold still. Okay, why 
watch out for the trap. Scared, huh? You should be. And there's another trap. Fucking coward hides. Let's see, I don't, I don't know what those traps set off. I don't see a bomb. Uh, I don't see a bomb or anything anywhere. But anyway, so watch out for those two traps. And then, let's see. there you are, you little bastard. <laughs> There is a picket fencing, Excellent. which allows you to build picket fencing. Take that. There's a green steamer trunk with some cool loot in there. 50 caliber sniper rifle, that's nice. Stud leather, chest piece. Um, and... Gwinnett Brew Recipe. We're going to take that. It's the recipe to how to make their beer. Uh, now, you look at Tower term Tom's Park, uh, yeah, Terminal, Ward, W-A-R-D, that's it, there we go, okay, trouble, crew's getting restless, plenty of beer, food's getting low, closest reserves is federal stockpile, but it seems Lily and Red Tourette's parents never taught those bitches to share, if you remember, we went through the federal stockpile already, um, Tried to storm the stockpile, but Lily and Red and the crew were dug in. Um, wiped out half our... Dragon Hook managed to grab a couple of hostages. Okay. Jackpot. Turns out the hostage is Lily, which is Red's sister. You know, just as we found out when we were over there. You know, it's so much food. That's awesome. And then... Tom killed Lily when she was trying to escape. And then he sent he didn't want anyone to find out, so he sent his crew out on a fake mission while he hid her body in one of the vats and he says, you know what, I even I think the brew tastes better. And then this is here because we uh, well, because I went and killed everybody over there. Someone iced Red and her whole crew. That was me. And so... And now we iced all of his crew. And I, I have a feeling that... Um, if you kill everyone here first... And then kill everyone over there second... When you go over the... Uh, the terminal... There at the federal... Uh, stockpile... There's probably an additional message about someone having killed everyone here, but I don't know. Uh, I don't know if sure. Haven't haven't tried that. Uh, anyway, so there's a, a weapons workbench. Um, a couple other things I just want to show you. This is not uh, this is not more loot. We've gotten all of the significant loot here. You know, there's there's a bunch of beer and then empty beer bottles and all kinds of stuff like that. But there's no other real loot here. Um, but there's a couple things that I just found amusing. Uh, first, can you bear the love? Got a couple of teddy bears making out. Aww. Or, well, making making it. Ooh. Can you bear the love? So, there we go. And next, there is a chemistry station here. And a bag with a little bit of weapons. And a bunch of beer. You know, like I said, beer bottles and empty beer bottles and full beer bottles all over the place. But grab the weapons out of the duffel bag. Then up and to the right. And you got a guy who's been dead for a really long time. Uh, he probably started drinking when the nuclear war started. And, and then died here. 
And then um, one other thing. Oh, uh, here. Spring this trap. And then get the weapon, combat shotgun, out of there. And then over to the west, and then north. There is a vault lunch lunchbox. And here we've got the bear with the coffee in, in the newspaper sitting on a hot plate with a sweet roll. You know, just having, having breakfast, reading the paper. So there we go. Okay, and uh, that is Beantown Brewery. Thanks for watching the video. This is Joel, and I will talk to you again soon. Peace.